Yeah, we're going to get to what we said to each other uh, because I was misquoted by saying that I said, fuck you, congratulations, after the game when we saw each other, <laughs> which is not what I said. I was like, I don't remember that one. I was I was, uh, I was a loss, uh, loss of words, and uh, you didn't – you didn't really say much, but I know you didn't say fuck you. I yeah, I that. mean, I didn't say much because I wanted you to go celebrate with your team. You know, I knew that you were going to feel bad for me, and I didn't uh, want that. Uh, yeah. I didn't want that to be uh, how you remembered that. So I just kind of made an emphasis to uh, go hug you, tell you I love you, congratulations, and go be with your teammates because I didn't want to be the guy that was going to bring down that moment for you. Yeah, well, um, there wasn't there wasn't much you could do about me feeling like that. Was, so, uh, and you could have told me "fuck you," and I would have still felt <laughs> the exact same way that I felt with you just telling me to go celebrate with your teammates. Is uh, that wasn't an easy feeling, and I would just definitely lost at words. But um, I did say one thing, and uh, I told you it was the funnest year of my life. Yeah, it was a great time, it, and um, I agree. It was a it was an awesome year. Uh, the podcast we've never talked more throughout. Any NFL season, um, yeah, I mean, man. it was that's a, what that's what it was all about for me, man. To to see this script or however you want to call it uh, play out like it did, um, and to be set in schedule every single week to talk it over with you, man. That was um, that was something I could have never drew up. Uh, I could have never, you know, expected it to be this damn fun, man. And uh, it it really did blindside me. And um, it was about halfway through the season. I was like, man, I'm having a fucking good old time this year, man. Uh, Body doesn't feel like it. And uh, this year was definitely the hardest year in terms of being uh, being ready game by game uh, and things like that. But uh, in terms of the the type of season that we had as a team and then on the type of season that we had, me and you um, as a team on this show and the producers and everybody involved. yeah, man, it was uh, it was definitely the the best the best season of my life, man. And um, yeah, the crazy part is is that I would never be playing this damn game if it wasn't for you. Stop. Um, no, nah, sure it is. Was. It's the truth, man. I followed your footsteps into it. I actually tried to play football uh, when you started playing football. So you started playing hockey. I started playing hockey. You started playing football. I started playing football. Um, yeah. There was pretty much every sport except for basketball like that. You started yeah. playing lacrosse. I started playing lacrosse. Um, so, yeah, I've kind of just been following your footsteps throughout this whole gig. And uh, to go through everything leading up to this moment uh, or leading up to this year and then having the year that we had um, and then meeting you at the mountaintop, brother, it was um, it was like we, uh, we were on top of that thing together, man. Yeah. And um, I always uh, – I always had a hate for Philadelphia secretly. <laughs> and man, the back they of didn't my draft mind, you? Yeah, because they took uh, an all star, um, my man Zach unbelievable Ertz. player, you know, very worthy of the pick. Um, but uh, I screwed up a few years of my life uh, not being able to play on the field with you. And I always hated uh, Philadelphia for not giving me that opportunity. Knowing that I had fucked it up so many times, I just wanted that one chance to, you know, team up with my dog, uh, the way I thought it was supposed to be. And um, I got so much respect for the Eagles organization, and uh, things happen for a reason, man. And yep. um, it was uh, it was cool to break the barrier of uh, two brothers going against each other. I don't think the story would have been the same. I don't think the drama would have been the same. I don't think people enjoy our family the same this week. That they did, uh, if 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 it if it's any other way. So, um, in a sense, uh, I don't hate the Eagles as much as I used to. <laughs> I, uh, I I have some appreciation for uh, for Roseman and Lurie taking uh, Zach Ertz. 